Hello everyone, Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor and... Psychic Damien. <laughs> <laughs> and today we are over in the newest, brand new community, Alpine Ridge by TriPoint Tri Homes. And as everyone knows, this is my favorite builder. They just opened up April 22nd and they have three floor plans to choose from and three models. Unfortunately, plan two is closed for the day, so I'm going to have to come back out here and make a special trip just to videotape plan two. Um, but they just opened up and it was cool. We met some uh, fans of ours in the uh, sales office that knew who we were. Love YouTube, folks. Anyway, let's get started. Like so, and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Before you do anything, like and subscribe. And if you want to buy in Kyle Point, they need to call me. Angelo Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor at 702-370-5112. Awesome sauce. So this is plan one. And I do believe this is the same floor plan they have over at Kings Canyon, the plan one. I've sold two of these plans and they're a very good layout. So this one is the smallest out of the three at 2379 square feet. Three to four bedrooms, two and a half to three bathrooms, and a three car garage. And the base price starting out is at five hundred and sixty four thousand. Now the nice thing is the HOA is seventy five dollars a month. It is a gated community. They will have a community park, and there are no sids or lids. So that's awesome. Ooh. Wow. I like that. Yeah, this, this is cool. Mm -hmm. I like the um, concrete. Stone. Yeah. The, uh, concrete, see, concrete, this is the right. problem with looking at new construction homes because I get so many freaking ideas. But this would be a great idea for our patio mm -hmm. instead of what we have now. Yes. And our entryway. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Like I like it. Very beautiful. Nice bright orange door. Private. Mm -hmm. Very private. Problem with looking at model homes. Get yourself in trouble. Trouble. <laughs> All right, we're gonna pan. Do a quick pan, and then we're gonna start to the right. Okay. So in this floor plan right here is the little den area. This one could be the fourth bedroom. You can convert this into the fourth bedroom. And if that was the case, then part of the primary closet would be taken up and there would be a bathroom attached to that bedroom. And it would be a good size bedroom. Then you have two bedrooms back here. Love, 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 love these floors. Yes. These are probably engineered hardwood. Um, this is what I would have really have liked, mm. but we went with the luxury vinyl. So to the left is the first bedroom. And um, it's a very decent sized bedroom. It's probably bigger than your standard size. It feels bigger than 12 by 12, mm -hmm. maybe 14 by 14. Then you have the Jack and Jill bathroom with the beautiful dark gray quartz countertops, the white shaker cabinets, the brushed chrome hardware. And they just went with the traditional builder grade tub shower insert. Which, to me, it looks fine. It, I mean, for me, I would probably do this in the secondary bathroom. Then you have the nice tall ceilings, the two can lights, and the pre-wire for a ceiling fan. So in my videos, I always say this. When you buy new construction, the thing that comes with the house is, for the most part, everything comes carpeted, and the only areas that come tiled is the kitchen and your wet areas, like your laundry room and bathrooms. Um, I would spend my money on getting at least four to six inch baseboards and I would spend my money on the flooring. I would make sure that I would at least, if I was on a budget, put carpeting in the bath bedrooms and then keep the hard surfaces elsewhere. People are loud. Okay. So then here you have a little closet with your smart panel. And then you'll have a half bath to the left. They did a good job, just simple, with the same quartz countertops and the white shaker cabinets. And then in here they added the cabinets, which is an upgraded option, and the sink is an upgrade as well. 
And when you buy new construction, the appliances do not come with the house. So the washer, dryer, and refrigerator do not come unless you spend extra money for that. And um, the only appliances that typically come are your you know, microwave, cooktop, oven, and dishwasher. So as you walk in, you have the tall ceilings. Now this will not come with the house. This is just an upgrade. And so is the uh, stonework around it. Okay. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> then we're going to go to the primary bedroom. Now, this is an upgraded option as well. This cabinet, uh, if you would like it here, would have to pay extra for it. This room, the ceiling comes slanted, which is nice. The four can lights and then the pre-wire 4A ceiling fan. So not only will you're going to pick your upgrades, like this is an upgrade, you're also going to pick your electrical package, which could be how many can lights you want in the house and if you want it pre-wired for a ceiling fan. If it were me, I would spend that money on that electrical package because having a ceiling fan option in every room is something worth having. So this is the biggest trend here in Vegas is the oversized shower. Too big for me. And then you have the double vanity with the same quartz countertops, the white shaker cabinets, now, when you buy new construction with TriPoint, you're going to go to the design studio and you're going to select your options. And that can start getting costly because not only are you going to select your tile work for your bathrooms, your flooring, your, all this is upgraded. And another thing is that this community just opened last week and they already opened two phases and sold out. They sold eight homes already. They do have people on a wait list. So if you're interested in this community and want to take advantage of it, I highly suggest you reach out to me as soon as possible um, so we can get you put on the wait list. Their next release will be on May 20th, which is a month almost. It'll be a little under a month. And the completion will be March 2024. So again, these homes, because they are single-story community, single-story homes by TriPoint, it's very important that you get in on the ground up before they do any more lot releases and before they increase the prices. Um, I will find out more about the lot premium, and I'll put it in the description below once I find out. So they spent extra money on the... What is this, 14 or 15 feet? Mm -hmm. Probably don't have access to the back because... Oh, let's oh, So then you have this nice covered patio. Looks like they did the concrete back here. Sometimes some builders will put pavers. Sometimes they'll put concrete. But I really like this hexagon look. I know, we do. It's kind of cute. Cement hexagon? Yeah, I'm a hexagon kind of gal. Like the fake grass in yeah, too. instead of we were going to do squares. Mm -hmm. So this is a cute little lot cute little yard ah uh, i like the wood look at the wood Ooh, look at that gray mm -hmm. that's actually kind of nice we always get design ideas when we come here <laughs> very tall ceilings then you have the oversized island separate dining room area So obviously these cabinets are an upgrade. They're probably the soft clothes. Clothes. Yeah. This has that trash in there. That's an upgrade. Then they have the double sink. And when you go to the design studio, you will select either getting a single basin sink, a double sink. Um, again, all these little things start adding up. They have the four pendant lights right here. And these appliances are the GE Monogram, the high-end appliances. And they will also have different appliance packages. So depending on how much you want to spend, they will have that. That's a kind of a cute backsplash. Yeah, unique and different. Yeah. And here, unlike Summerlin, they didn't do the Sub-Zero refrigerator. Mm -hmm. They just did a standard size refrigerator here. It's a, another GE monogram. Now, you can get the appliances, like the refrigerator, and washer, and dryer, through the builder. But that tends to cost a little more money than if you were to buy it on your own. And then you have the G-Monogram 
oven, built-in oven, and this is probably a microwave and convection oven as well. Yeah, it's like a convection oven. Then you have, the nice thing about this floor plan is also the large pantry. It's a good size pantry. I kind of like this green. It's a pretty green. What do you think? Yeah, I do. I like it too. It's like a sage. Yeah. It's a good feel. I like it. It goes good with the gray. Mm-hmm. Love the floors. Mm-hmm. So to summarize, we're over here at Alpine Ridge. This is plan one at 2379 square feet with an option of three to four bedrooms two and a half to three bathrooms and a three car garage. Base price starting right now as of today, 564,000. By the time you watch this video, they may already buy or have increased the base price. I highly recommend for a new community, the Vegas market is not crashing, it's not falling apart, especially for all single story homes, to get involved from the ground up because each lot release, they are going to be increasing the price. So again, if you want your favorite Las Vegas realtor to represent you, who do they need to call me, right? Angelo Hare. At? 702-370-5111. And Angelo Hare, Vegas Realtor. All right, folks, we'll see you on the next one. Peace out.